Hey guys, Ariel over here at Fineth, where you can see the garden that you've been hearing about my progress on, and I want to show you the one thing that I do actually have planted for my fall garden. I have a kind of winter climate that's not really conducive to a lot of what people think of as fall gardening. Um, most things people can grow in a fall garden in much of the country is what I can grow in the summer here, but there is one thing I plant in the fall that grows all winter, so I want to show you that. Here's a sneak peek at my garlic. So you can see how I just stacked all my little wire panels here that I normally use for trellises on top so that the, uh, if anything wants to come in from the top, they hopefully can't. See if I can have any luck hitting a, a garlic down here and just show you. Look, this is the top, the pointy part of the bulb, and look at all those beautiful healthy roots it's already growing. Now we're going to tuck it back in there but it is not visible above the surface at all, nor are any of the others under here, but they are down there busy growing, and that's why it's best to plant garlic in the fall if you can, because it gets a head start and you'll get a bigger garlic head in the spring. Now, if you live somewhere a little warmer and it has time to grow not just those roots you just saw, but to actually poke up whole, um, little green leaves. You don't want to grow a full plant, but if it pokes up some little green leaves before you get snow and, and frost, that's fine. I just planted this like a week ago because I didn't have my bed ready or my dirt in it. So pretty much no matter where you are, since I'm in one of the coldest places in the country, um, if you don't have garlic in right now, it's probably not too late to put yours in if you want to plant some garlic. And you definitely should, because if you watch any of my cooking videos, you'll know that garlic is one of the most awesome flavors and nutritious things to add to all kinds of stuff. So if you don't already have some in, go, even if you just got a windowsill or a deck or something, get a little pot and stick some cloves of garlic in it right now, and you will have your own garlic next summer. Thanks for watching, folks. If you're interested in more info on my off-grid tiny house life, check out some of my other videos here. And if you like what you're seeing, click the little picture of my house to subscribe and then hit the little bell so YouTube actually notifies you every time there's a new video available. See y'all next time!